Set to take on DJ Z. As Evolve 92 gets set to roll on here from Detroit. And what can we say about Fred Yei that we haven't said? The MVP of the World Wrestling Network over 2017, the current FIP World Heavyweight Champ. 483 days as FIP World Heavyweight Champ for Fred Yehi. He has eclipsed the 476 day reign of Homicide, the man who first wore that championship belt. And started off the rich history of men to hold the FIP World Heavyweight title. Amazing accomplishment for Fred Yehi, also a former Evolve Tag Team Champ. He has done it all, style battle winner. And DJ Z, a guy who has been all over the world, the national television star as part of Global Force Wrestling. But a man coming into this match with a lot of question marks himself, just getting back into the ring for the first time recently since a horrific injury back in April down in Mexico, wrestling for the crash, suffered a fractured colon. And the fear was, not only that he was never gonna wrestle again, there was a fear at some point he may lose his life through that injury after that matchup. But he's made a tremendous recovery. We're very excited to have the opportunity to see him here in a matchup against Fred Yehi, because this kid is supremely gifted. And the reaction in the wrestling world when that injury happened was just, you know, you see, you hear a lot of negative when it comes to wrestling, but you see how the community fans and the wrestlers and the promoters themselves pulled together when such a tragedy happened. But again, the, the intestinal fortitude, not to sound cliche, but this guy, you want to talk about heart. He's in the ring again already. I mean, it's unbelievable. And it looks like he has not lost a step. No, not a beat. Started in wrestling at the age of 17. Now in his 13th year as a pro. And he has improved by leaps and bounds over the last several years. And Yehi though, had him up. What a nice counter there. You gotta wonder how Yehi is gonna deal with the quickness of DJ Z, but more importantly right now, DJ Z has to be wondering how he's gonna deal with the unorthodox offense of Fred Yehi. 
as he will stomp you in places most people won't stomp you. Oh, it's unbelievable, and the accuracy, Ronnie Garvin would be jealous. These stomps are just vicious, and if anything's gonna slow you down, it's the stomps of Fred Yehi. Now going to the legs after wearing out the hands. And right to the midsection. May have just collapsed two of his eight abs. <laughs> unbelievable, you mentioned the eight abs, the conditioning this young man. To come back was one thing, but to come back in the condition he's in. I mean, what did he do? Did they have a gym set up in his hospital room? What's going on? Did they have a dietitian? The guy was eating cleaner than most of us are on the street. Well, myself, definitely. He's back to his feet, only to get oh a big, big hip toss out of the corner by Yehi. And Yehi guy looking to get back on the winning track here in Evolve. Had an opportunity back in Evolve 91 to regain the Evolve Tag Team Championships. Quick cover there and a one count after that suplex. As he teamed with Jason Kincaid in a losing effort against Anthony Henry and James Drake. As he left catch point after he and Hot Sauce Tracy Williams lost the Evolve Tag Team Championships to Jocka and Chris Dickinson, they never got their rematch, so both he and Williams were able to pick partners for individual rematches in the last set of shows, and both men failed to unseat the workhorsemen who are set to defend those championships later on tonight as DJZ into the corner up and over, but Yehi blocks it, handful of tights. Looking for a suplex, nice escape there by DJZ. It's Yehi sent into the corner instead. Leapfrog on the turnbuckles. And a springboard back elbow sends Yehi sprawling. DJZ really making a big impression here in his return to Detroit. International wrestling and TV star, Fred Yehi and DJ Z really going toe to toe here. You got it. You know, I seen the lineup coming into the show, and this one just stood out to me. Something about this match. I like the clash in styles. I really, just on paper, this was one that really got me excited. Nice counter there by AI. Blocked that chop, stopped on the foot, and delivered a stop of his own. Sweeps the legs, drop kick. Down goes DJ Z. And I'm sure. Fred Yehi happy to be in the ring with somebody a little bit more his size after his match back at Evolve 90 where he failed to win the Progress Wrestling Atlas Championship. That's for the big lads over 205 against the gigantic Volter. In a matchup which Yehi took the big man to the limit. Reversal and into the barricade goes DJ Z. As this one is taken to the streets here in Detroit. Fred Yehi thrown through the air, lands somewhere over on eight mile. DJ Z, ready to fly. Up and over the guardrail, Fez pressed to the floor. Pretty sure that's not what Lou Thez had in mind when he came up with the Thez press. It was, however, extremely effective as DJ Z rolling Yehi back towards the ring and looking to capitalize here shoulder block to the midsection slingshots over the top somersaults back to his feet but Yehi plants him with a flapjack gut wrench turns him inside out not once but twice the lesser test lift Gut wrench into the side, Salto suplex by Yehi, flashing the power here in Detroit. Hover for the win, only two. Yeah, just the strength of the abdominal muscles, Fred Yehi just shown ridiculous, basically toying with DJ Z before dropping him. Yehi is so methodical. I love to watch him at work in the ring. He just basically is stalking his prey the entire time he's in there. Escape by DJZ. Hurricane Rana blocked. Yehi goes to the floor to try and create some distance. And now he's going to take a walk. DJZ had some high impact offense in store for Yehi, who had none of it. Dives instead. 
and wipes out Yehi. Not to be denied, DJZ. He was coming off that ring apron one way or the other, wipes out Fred Yehi. Referee starts his count. A little bit of a quick count now. That I watch him, they better get in that ring. DJ Z has no interest in a double count out or victory by count out. He wants a decisive victory over Yehi. Up and over connects. One motion right into the Asai Mutsu for the win. And only two. DJ Z is so smooth in everything he does. He really is. He just makes everything look easy. Lenny walking into the building earlier. I tripped twice and I, I bumped my knee on the sound booth. DJ Z, pretty much the opposite of everything I just said. Well, you're getting a little older. I am old and feeble, according to some. And now it's DJ Z looking to tie up Yehi here. He's got a cloverleaf with the arm trapped at the same time here. We're Referee right there asking Fred if he wants to give it up. He does not. And DJ releases the hold. A very back and forth matchup here. Either man able to gain a sustained advantage in this one. Oh, very evenly matched, you're right. And you know, Lenny, the fans at WWNlive.com for a long time, they've been asking for DJ Z. They got him here tonight in Detroit. Yay high up kicks to the chest, just peppering the pectoral region of DJ Z. Who staggers to the corner. Only to connect with an elbow. Up and over, right on the knee. Yehi, dazed right there, but DJ Z not going for the cover. He's got more as he waits in the corner for Yehi to get back to his feet. And he took too much time. Rolled right into it. Fred Yehi nearly decapitating DJ Z, referee checking on him. To say it, but I think it's going to take a little bit more unless Red Yehi capitalizes right now. He needs to move quick if he's going to get that pinfall, but Yehi still feeling the effects of the offense and DJ Z himself. Both men down. Feeling the punishment from their competitor. Fred Yehi trying to sh shake off the cobwebs. Who's going to be up first? Double count continues, and it is DJ Z up first. And Yehi shortly thereafter blocks and hits a right hand of his own. Beats DJ Z to the punch. No more chops, he says. Well, Yehi thinks differently. Forearm. Catches the foot. And cracks the back. Is it enough for the win here in Detroit? No. Yehi, you can clearly tell by the expression on his face, thought he had won the match. Not quite DJ Z kicking out at the last second. Yehi, looking like a man possessed in there. The fans getting behind him. Fans in Evolve always love Yehi. Everywhere he goes. Just the intensity that he goes at everything he does with. Contagious. And DJ Z up kicks himself. Taking a page out of Yehi's book right there. Oh, but Yehi caught him. Release German suplex by the FIP World Heavyweight Champ. Rolling elbow countered. Chin breaker by DJ Z. Nicely done. Both these men are on wobbly legs here. Up and over into the corner. Into a Right to the center. Fisherman Buster for the cover and the win now. You got to be kidding me, Lenny. Red Yehi throwing everything at DJ Z in a spectacular match. So far here in Detroit, the fans loving what they see. Got to agree with them. This is awesome, Lenny.
And it is anybody's ball game right here. As J.I. says that's it for DJ Z. Stalks him in the corner. Yehi wearing him out with those knife edge chops. Unbelievable agility by DJ Z. Plants him right on his head. DJ Z for the upset window. Now you see the frustration on the face of DJ Z. Can't believe he hasn't finished Fred Yehi. Not sure I can believe he hasn't finished him after that, but you uh, know. He spiked him right on his head with that DDT, but Yehi dug down as the champion does and got the shoulder up. DJ Z all the way to the top now. Up kick from Yehi. Into the Koji clutch. He's got it hooked right in the middle of the ring. And it's over. Nowhere for DJ Z to go. And forced to give it up to Fred Yehi's Koji Clutch here in Detroit. Yeah, 
performance was worth five hundred dollars. Okay, okay, okay. You want to know what I think it was worth? Fred, I don't think your performance was worth $500. I think it was worth $500.